seems that Boris Johnson is going to survive. Uh, in part, we'll see the police handing out COVID fines later. Uh, you know whether the anger's changed or not. But there's a new communications person who apparently was greeted with I will survive singing from the current Prime Minister. <laughs> Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. The new communications person, who is a Remainer, hates Brexit, thinks it's a terrible thing. The new communications director, who, when he worked with Boris, when Boris was mayor of London, suggested total amnesties for all illegal migrants that came to Britain. Oh, I nearly forgot. The communications guy, whose previous job was lobbying on behalf of Huawei, the Chinese state wow. telecoms company, to take over control of our 5G network. This guy is a globalist. He's a hard left liberal. And the fact that Boris Johnson has now appointed him as his spokesman tells you everything you need to know. And my real anger and upset with Johnson isn't party gate, even though to tell the rest of the country not to go and visit their grandmother and party the high life in Downing Street was arrogant. And even though he's refused to tell the truth about it, the fact is he masqueraded in 2016 as a you know, patriotic conservative who believed in border controls. And what we've got is a metropolitan liberal, pro-China globalist who seems to almost regret having ever backed Brexit. And that's why I think he must go. And that's why, you know what? I still think, I still say, he won't survive this. Good stuff. Nice to talk to you, Nigel. We'll talk again into the future. If you want to get even more of his views, go to Flash, where you can get his show each and every day on GB News or all of the online portals. Thank you very much, mate.